Ardrossan Castle is situated on the west coast of Scotland in the town of Ardrossan, Ayrshire. The castle, defended by a moat, stands on a ridge above the town. There is a keep dating from the 15th century, and a vaulted range containing a kitchen and cellars. In a deep passageway, there is a well. Part of the keep remains up to the corbels of the parapet, but it is in ruins. The original castle, owned by Clan Barclay, was partly destroyed during the wars of Scottish independence. This event, in which the English garrison was slaughtered, became known as Wallace's Larder, a name which is still applied to the remaining vaults. Rebuilt by Clan Montgomery in the 15th century, Ardrossan later fell into disuse and was partially demolished by the soldiers of Oliver Cromwell in the 17th century, who used the stones to help construct the air citadel. This castle is the subject for a ghost lore story, featuring the ghost of William Wallace. The castle is said to be haunted by the ghost of William Wallace, who is said to wander the ruins on stormy nights. The castle is also associated with the devil. Sir Fergus Barclay, also known as the Dial of Ardrossan, was a horseman, famous around the lands for his tremendous skill. The secret to his skill, however, was a magical bridle, which was given to Barclay by the devil, in exchange for his soul. However, the devil was tricked by Barclay into giving his soul back. Infuriated by this trickery, the devil attacked the castle in his rage, and is said to have left his hoof prints on one of the rocks. Sir Fergus Barclay is buried in the castle chapel, situated a few hundred yards inland from the castle, further down the hill, 